Hello, and welcome back to Operator Status. Still in the non-ultra-hard extreme mode version of the game, because I learned of something. So, I was looking around, uh, I was backing up my save, and I noticed in the music folder for the game, there's all the music we've heard, and then there's secret. There's a secret song with like the title Crackbound and contributing artists is Soul Eye. I don't know what that really means, but there's a secret. I clearly haven't heard that song, so there's more to the game. And I looked into it and I, I found a thread with someone saying exactly this. I found a secret song and what is that about? Does anyone know? And someone said there was like a secret wall to be found that's not like other walls. And I was going to leave it at that, but then I kind of just accidentally read everything else. Accidentally, I said, I just happened to read the thread. And apparently it's in the packet router, which is sort of what I had assumed, honestly, because I don't really see where a secret could be in Niflis Forest. And apparently it's around the part where you got the magnet power. That's about all I know, and I looked at that in the last episode in editing, and I have like one idea for where it could be, but the guy also said you might need to change gravity in order to get in there. And that's weird to me because I don't feel like you would need to if it is where I think it is. So, I don't know. We'll check it out uh, in the first place. Let's see where I even am here because I haven't loaded the game since I beat the game and just quit, so... Am I just at the end? Oh. Yeah, I'm here. Okay. Uh, but I can leave. Alright, so we can get out and try and find that, so it's gonna be a little annoying getting back, but at least I can do it. So that's good. Oh, also, I feel like... Is it... Oh god, hold on. I need to... Not die here. One second. Alright, that's fine. I feel like my volume is very low. Yep, my volume was really low. Okay, there we go. I don't think it affects the recording, because everything was low, so... It should be... Oh god! It should be the same regardless. Uh, and I guess I can, like, try and get up here. That might be... Safer. There we go. Alright, and save here. I'm just gonna save again. I've already saved the backup in case I need to go back to the end, but I could just go back to the end. Alright, my nemesis, this jump. There we go. That's not that bad. So, it's somewhere over here. Oh crap, okay, a little bit ambitious. And now suddenly it's it's too loud for me. I need to lower the volume a little bit more. Oh! I didn't know they worked like that. If you just hit them, even if you hit them from below, you still get sent up. That's good to know. Alright. So in this sort of area, and the only place I can think of is up there, right above me here. Because... They said that the wall would look different, but I don't see any place here or here. There's no wall that looks off or like it's not supposed to look that way. Oh, what? Oh my god, oh my god, if I like really fucking look hard. Yeah, I can see that, okay. Fair enough. Well, that's weird. And maybe I do have to change gravity. So, you have to go up here, and then probably fall- oh my god. Fall up, or- I'm assuming I just have to have gravity going right. Okay, well, so it's not up here, that's what I- where I thought it would be, so let me just test this again. If I just, like, do this, come on. Oh man. I just want to get in there. 
But man, that is hard to know that that's there. I did not see that in editing, I did not see it now, I, that was a complete accident. So that's very, uh, rough finding that. Oh man, it's hard to get in there. Alright, fuck that, whatever, I found it. I'm not sure if there's more. I did hear that, like, after you complete the secret, you basically unlock another secret, or like a secret mode, and then I think there was one further thing once you complete that. There was, like, something else, maybe. Not sure. So, that's the lever I need. And is that the only one that points there? Because I guess that kind of makes sense. Then we have to, like, survive. Hold on, let me... Uh, no, I don't even want to save. That's actually more annoying to go, go in that side. So, yeah, it's this way. And we have to, like, avoid all these guys and get to the, uh, the clone ball. Ow. Okay, let's try the other way. Just go all the way down instead. Yeah, there we go. As I've said, I really hate controlling the ball and this orientation or any weird orientation. I knew there would be something to getting up here with this orientation, because, like, it just felt like it's so obvious that you have to do it. But it's just weird that it was nothing. But now, what even am I supposed to do here? So the ball... The ball still can't touch the, uh... The checkpoint there. Oh my god, this is hard to control. Nope. Oh my god, I hate this. I really hope this is not, like, what it's gonna be like in the secret area, because I... This is, like, my least favorite part of this entire game. This direction switching. I just think it's so fucking annoying and not fun as a mechanic. Oh boy. So... Can he touch the lever? No, he cannot. Oh, because I can't- I see. But then... But then how the fuck do I do anything here? There's no way that you have to get here the normal way, get charged with a laser power-up, and then get up back the normal way and, like, coming the way I did now before it runs out. I don't think that's possible. I might just want to read the thread and see if someone says something about this, because this this seems insane. Nope, I am not seeing anything. No information anywhere, so I guess I'm on my own. I'll try to find a different way, because this seems insane. I don't think it's even possible to just go right there. So I have to go somewhere else, but where? Like, over here? There was nothing, right? Oh, god damn it. Alright, so... That's cool. That's really cool. Alright, let's see. I just want to see if there's a fucking lever over there. Is that so much to ask? Wait, what? Where? Where is the gap? There's supposed to be like a gap in here, but it's like the pattern is different. This isn't the normal pattern. That's not the normal pattern at all. What the hell is that about? And yeah, I can go in there, but that doesn't help me. And this doesn't have a lever anywhere. What is what is going on? Where am I supposed to go? Okay, good. Oh, there's one, right. Okay, so wait, this will take me back. Yeah, this is back to uh, 
the normal starting area. Okay, so it's not that insane. Good. But now I need to not die here, which is easier said than done. Okay, good. Still need to not die, though. Okay, good. Still need to not die, though, because I'm not getting a save point. Finally. Okay. And then we go up here. Soul Eyes Secret. And finally we get a save. Exit level. Okay, so... I'm assuming this is gonna be really fucking stupidly hard if they just let you exit the level when you, like, want to die. So, uh... Let's see how fun this is. Oh, that that's death. Okay, well, fair enough. And I guess this is the secret song. Oh, man. Some straight-up chiptune. Chris... What? Christophori? Who is that? Uh-oh. Okay, good. No, 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 not good. Don't tell me you have to do this entire thing without any checkpoints. Please don't tell me that's a thing. Please do not tell me that it's like 10 screens without any checkpoints. I don't want that to be a thing. I don't want to do that. Stop. Okay, good. Va valet? I can't read that! It's so fucking tiny! I don't know what it's saying! Where do I even want to go? I assume right, because I'm assuming left is just death. Okay, good. Ro Rogita? I seriously can't read these. They're too tiny and pixelated. Oh no. Oh no, how do you do that? How do you fucking do that? I'm gonna die here. I don't want to die here. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. Crytopic. Shab... Shabud... What? Fuck these. I don't want to read them anymore. It's just... I guess Espernet users or something, or Mod Archive users. Um... Is it even possible to... jump that high? Uh, how? There we go. Holy shit. Please just give me a save point. I don't... I don't want to do this again. I know I'm gonna fail. I'm gonna die on something. Press M plus S to activate cheat mode. Then hold X to use the zero clipping device. Funky mode light. What? Wait, M plus S. Uh, okay, then hold X, and, and I'm dead. Thanks, game. That's nice of you. But what does that mean? So now I, I fucked that up, and I can't get the funky thing, and probably will have to do it again. So wait, if I hold X now, I just fall out. But what, what does that do? Why would I want to do that, ever? Can I, like... No, I can't grab to go wherever I want or anything like that. So I guess now I need to do it again because of that. And if I just, like, hold it and then let go, it comes back. So if I hold it, like, here... Wait. Okay, so maybe we can cheat our way through here. Oh my god. 
Okay, alright. Well, here I don't think I can... Well, maybe. No, what? That doesn't have collision? I let go of X and it still didn't work. If I let go now, yeah, it's like going back through a wall doesn't have collision, even if you don't have the code active. So yeah, I do need to do this one, normally. Alright, that's, that's actually kind of consistent. That's not too bad. But here I need to do this jump again, because, uh... I can't cheat this one. Oh, fuck. Fuck you! Okay, I should just do that. And fail, but if I die now, I know, yeah, I'll just do that. That's better. Oh man, this fucking game. Okay, good. That's better at least. Let's see if I can do this one again. No, 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 that's not what I want. Yep, at least that part is nice and consistent. I like it. Fuck you! Oh, well, that wasn't what I planned, but that worked. Yeah, this, this section is just really fucking difficult. How do you even get the height needed here? Oh, man. Oh, that, that would have been good. Okay, there we go. Finally. But it's still not over. There we go. Okay. Alright. Okay. I'm done. Again. So I know that. M and S and then X. I assume you have to press M and X like every time... Uh, M and S to activate it every time you play the game or something. You know what? Fuck this. I'm gonna do this. Just to make sure I get that. So, Funky Mode Light is active now, I guess? But what does that do? Nothing seems to be different. I have a red magnet now instead of the blue. Oh yeah, everything is just like different colors. But what does that mean? Does that do anything? Also, I can just ignore all this. That's actually quite nice. Yeah, nice. Okay. And then let's save, I suppose? Cool. Uh, so does anything here look different? In funky mode light? Don't really see anything. Also, I'm pretty sure I heard something about, like, you need to use the thing that you get here in, uh, whatever that place was called. You need to use it- oh! Boss again? Really? Even though I've already beaten the boss? Okay, fine. Uh, well, not- not fine. I might leave this for- for next time, I guess. I think I want to leave it off here. But I did hear something about you need to, uh, get to the end of Niflis Forest and then use the power that you picked up there, which is obviously the no-clip thing. I don't know exactly where that would be, but yeah, we'll- we'll check it out. So, I'll leave it off here, and we'll see if I'm still alive by the time I get back. Otherwise, we'll just redo the boss. So, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoy- ah, I'm dead. Okay. Hope you enjoyed. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye!